The mission of VCAT is to provide fair, efficient and accessible justice. Um, it's part of what is set in our legislation, but it is um, part of the ethos of this place. VCAT's experiment with online dispute resolution started back when we worked with the Department of Justice on the Access to Justice uh, review. And in that review, it became um, clear that there was significant unmet need. An online dispute resolution was put forward as something that needed to be explored as a way of meeting that need. So there were several submissions that brought to our attention the potential of online dispute resolution. And what the review said was that you know, it's really important to run a pilot first, to evaluate it and then to learn from it. The VCAT pilot in online dispute resolution is a pilot program aimed at exploring whether there's a simple, efficient and effective way to resolve small civil claims disputes at VCAT. We had a hypothesis out there that said that if VCAT was to introduce online dispute resolution, then the Victorian community will experience improved access to justice. Um, and I guess the reason we decided to attempt to prove or disprove this hypothesis um, is because this is not an IT project. The last thing you want to do is put in a system that no one's going to use. You need to understand the why. So we brought everybody in and we've created this space um, to be able to do that. We saw, well, first the uh, fantastic uh, business process mapping uh, that had been done that identified all of these pain points as they seem to be called. Uh, it identified clearly where the potential lies for an ODR function. And then we were shown the prototype that Modron has already developed which will be piloted with a handful of live cases. Modron has joined the project to take the broad solution that we have and figure out where VCAT will be able to get the biggest advantages from applying technology to the process. We have developed a series of personas that represent everyday Victorians with everyday business problems and we've taken up the role of those people in a dispute situation trying to work together with VCAT's help to sort things out. One of the things that we've had really strong and positive feedback about our tool is that much of it is second nature to people already. We're focused on video chat and text chat and the kinds of things that you're doing with your friends and family already, but applying them towards um, situations that are, that are kind of scary. So in some ways, technology can give people a soft landing into circumstances that are otherwise um, quite daunting for them understanding what are the cultural factors, what are the skills and capability, what's the mindset and behaviours people need to adopt has actually been really helpful for us. We all operate in a world um, that's very set up to service physical infrastructure. You know, we, we need hearing rooms, we need um, members, we need application forms. What online dispute resolution does is enable us to just reimagine all of that. The results that we are beginning to see from this work are so compelling and so clear cut that even for the most cautious of people, there's a new level of openness to exploring the applications of technology in this space even further. The department thinks there is real potential in ODR, not just in small claims, but potentially also in other types of claims at VCAT, more minor criminal matters, and potentially even in larger uh, civil matters. The goal now for me is to take this as far as we can take it in terms of testing the pilot and in terms of gathering as, as much rich evidence as we can to support a business case so that we can actually put this service that we're building uh, into production. One of the questions in our last survey was whether or not if online dispute resolution was available, would people embrace it? More than 70% of people identified that they would be interested in utilising services provided in that manner. The capacity to do more and more um, utilising online dispute resolution technology is clearly um, the way of the future.